Welcome back to Project Zomboid. It's Ferrand here and today we are kicking off in our nice humble abode. So the past few days we've been doing a lot of just base work and today I kind of like to spruce it up a bit. So a few episodes back I drove through what looked like one of the cooler industrial sites. It's a big old rail yard and on our brief flyby I saw a stupid amount of crates. I'm kind of hoping in one of those crates at the very least we can get ourselves a wood axe or plenty of wood glue to make repairing our wood axe worth it. Now I'm not fully convinced I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't feel like this is gonna be like striking the mother load or whatever but we can certainly give it a go. So I reloaded all of the magazines for our Beretta so we've got 7 times 15 worth of ammo. Whatever that is, I'll let you guys do the maths. But yeah, we've we've got a fair bit. Got a fair bit. What have we got in here? Ah. Vehicle wasn't quite done. Let's just open, change, and repack that bad boy. Uh, I might just leave the bag on the ground. We'll take those though. Why not? Uh you know what? Screw it. Let's just unload this bad boy quick. Only take two seconds. Made it to our train track. We're not too far out, so it's maybe, maybe till nine o'clock. There is a big old bridge down there that I do need to be careful of. It looks unreal, but catches me off guard every single time. So tight as well. It's ah, oh, it's annoying. So annoying. <laughs> Here she is. Looks great, but just a little bit too tight for my liking. Just enough to squeeze through, which is nice, but still scary. Still scary. I can't remember which way we came in last time, but I'm kind of hoping it's down here. Should we just drive in and hope for the best? Yeah, screw it, why not? There's a few Z traps in front of us, but for the most part, not too bad. Just get out and crack on. Oh, we're in a lot of pain. We were in pain earlier, but I didn't think it was that bad. Ah, oh, it's very annoying. There's a cool Z with a stop sign too. Ah, that sucks. Um, hopefully that kicks in very quickly. Not ready for that level of pain. Not at all. We don't have the ammo for that level of pain. Come here, stop sign man. One big stop sign. Those cover us. Perfect. Now we're going to be our tailoring dream. Come in, folks. Bring it in. Yeah, that pain is slowly dropping. Yeah, I ended up doing some, some exercise last night and not good is the short answer. Not good at all. Plus side though, with that strength level up, you should slowly start working on fitness. So once once you get over encumbered, you start grinding strength. If you're not over encumbered, you get working on fitness. Fingers crossed. That should be the kicker to actually start doing this properly. Five, two, seven, two. One kill gets us 5273. We've only got to kill 3,000 more Zs. <laughs> 5274. It's like every swing. 5275. Ah. Swing that makes contact. Makes sense. Annoying, but makes sense. Can we get in here? Probably not. Expecting a locked door. Yep. Standard. Um, anything open around here? No. Great start though. I'll take it. One swing to dying off, but the amount we've got is worth the trade. There we go. Nicely done. Oh. What a tank. Oh, there is a construction Z in there. With some duct tape. Wood glue. Perfect. And duct tape. Oh, quids in today. Perfect. Couple of nails in there too. I'm not going to stress too much about those. I've got like 11 boxes at home now. Finally raking it in. If nails were a currency, we would be rich. Just glue. It's not what I want to do. I want to climb into a nice clear window, not fumble over a crate. Let's 
he does it. And big donk for you and for you. And another construction worker too. More wood glue. Oh. Do you reckon we could get a double, double whammy? Oh, not quite. Ah, oh, you're joking. Yeah, that's not good. Wonder if we can repair that with a with duct tape. So we've got plenty. Just in time for the pain too. Classic. Cheers, guys. More wood glue. Well, this trip has been worth worth its weight in gold just from the wood glue. Was that Louisville map or yeah? Repair with duct tape. Perfect. Oh, just like that, we are back in action. We're off to a good start down there. No, we're off to a great start. It's been a while since I've been this lucky. Got some seeds already. That's exactly what I want to see. What are they? Black beans and onions. And a peach seed. Be nice if that peach seed is actually visible. Propane. Some welding rods. Some good stuff. Turpentine. Generator. Yeah, this place is going to be a gold mine. This place is going to be a gold mine. Let's just get this back door unlocked. And probably get one of these unlocked too. Guess this is probably the next logical spot to hit. It is open too. And hopefully another two tubes of wood glue. Banking on you boys. Nah, I should not close that door. We did get lucky. Hmm. Do they count as outside? They do. Oh, wood glue and a box of nails. Outrageous. Hmm. We can actually take it down. If we had a welder's mask. Could be smooth sailing straight on through. Okay, well we don't really have too much left out here to look at. What's the other side like? The other side is Warehouse City. That is where we want to be. There's one, two, three. We're gonna fly through this place. Long blade is flying through as well. Axes are far behind it. Oh. Dreamy, 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 dreamy. That katana's gonna be next level. Lovely. Oh, needle as well. Perfect. Oh, this place. This place is either gonna be our death or the biggest blessing in the world. So I feel like all this luck, there's gotta be some bad, doesn't there? Oh, plenty of gas. Okay, let's just check it in a hurry. No gas either. No dramas. Any of them open? It is open and it does have duct tape. How about you? You gonna give me the same luck? No. Open but no dice. Okay, any good gear? Doesn't look like it. Wonder if we could give the axe a go. Did not want to pull that many. Did not want to pull that many at all. But that's okay. It's okay when you're that good with weapons, isn't it? Didn't realise the reach on this thing was so short. I'll tell you what. He looks so much better without that, <laughs> without that rubber ring on him. So ridiculous. But equally wonderful. Uh, not what I want to see. Guess we can always switch out to a reliable. Get some distance in that too. It's kind of hoping to keep those overalls in one piece, but yeah. Absolutely not. All that stabbing have just sent them down the drain. 
Oh, we have got a little warehouse to check. Almost guarantee there isn't a chair to rest on there. Oh, come on. Just like that. Luck disappears in a heartbeat. Guess we have got one simple way out, don't we? Nice. Suppressed handgun. Maybe suppressed. Oh. Empty handgun. Not good. <laughs> Beautiful. Love it. Absolutely love it. Guns in this game are just something else. I wish, wish to God, uh, guns were in, no, silence guns were in the base game. Wouldn't mind going to Riverside Gun Store either. That does look like fun. So it's, it's another new mod map as well, so we're not, not diving back into the old, old trusty routes. New place, new troubles. I think that one's locked. This one's good. Probably should have brought something to be able to sleep on, like a tent. A tent would have been perfect. I think we're good. Cheeky can of sardines, and let's get the show on the road. I wonder if this is fully industrial or if that's half residential. If we can get somewhere to sleep, that'd be lovely. Yeah, sneaking's never going to go up down here, is it? A lot of groups, but we're just getting spotted from pretty much every direction. Not really what we want. Can we still break these down? No. Left the scissors at home. Is that... Can I hear that? Can you guys hear that? you got to be joking, man. You have got to be joking. Why do I never check the radio? Ah, oh, please be open. Yes. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Big no, no. <laughs> oh, that could have been very, very bad. Uh, hopefully, we can just hide away in here. It's a garage. Christ. Yeah, none of this looks good. Tow bar. Big wheels. Some mighty tire repair glue. Annoying thing is, gonna do all of this and just get overrun by the helicopter anyway. But we can maybe put it off as long as we can. Christ. Still not through that front door. That is a surprise. There's no back door. If we can pull this off. Okay, I'm going to try and run this race as long as I possibly can. Ah, there goes the front door. That's all downhill from here. What do you reckon? Can we withstand it? <laughs> we have got a katana as a last resort. I will just pull it out. This could be like a ridiculous last hurrah. I mean, we're not dying. Absolutely not. I'll get a thousand miles away before I let her get to that point, but could be quite fun. Ah, damn it. It's the one thing I did not want to see. Is 
If only our fitness was higher. Do you know what I mean? If we were one level up in fitness, we could have actually stood the chance here. Anything in the bathroom? Just a Zed. No chairs we can rest on or anything, is there? DIY vehicle parts magazine. Not that something we need. Alright, I'm gonna try and take a sneaky rest. With one door down. This does not fill with hope. Not for a second. Why is it always the helicopter? Every single time. I was going to crack that open, but we're also starving. Get him on, lads. Leave the door alone. There's only one of you as well. Sounds like more than one. Yeah. Not many more. Ah, they were hiding, that's why. Uh, glue, duct tape. Maybe we take the backup leather gloves. Nightstick and the Smith and Western we'll leave on the ground. Hey pal. Yeah, we'll take the gloves. Little last resort. Wonder if we can get upstairs yet. Should we try it? Is that too risky? I can hear banging, but I can't see any moving. Do you know what I mean? Hey, old fella. Ah, okay, we can't sleep in there. Some nails, broom, two point sling. Very strange thing to have in a warehouse, but I'm not going to question it. Just going to take it and go. Bundle of short bolts. We need the long bolts. Alright, we can sleep in here, but I'm not doing it on this level. Not a chance. Silence is a representation of just pure fear. Metal baseball bat. Oh, it's battered. 65% just with a propane torch. We can get that up. That's coming home with me. Lettuce. Pata Nosta Floater. Some sort of brand, I'm assuming. Oh, I might put that scarf on as well. Tiny bit of extra neck protection. Never hurt anyone. One pen, pencil, bunch of gear we don't really need. Dink. Fitness contraption. One tarp could be a good start to our tent journey. Nothing else we really need though. Is this up to the roof or is there going to be more places to sleep? Nah, just straight to the roof. That's all good. Uh, club hammer and a metal sheet. Not too bad. And the stair access as well. So if we can't get out on the ground floor, we can just head straight up. Nice. We're going to have to sleep here, aren't we? Yep. This is going to have to happen. Ah, this is not going to be fun. This is not going to be fun at all. Ah, that's where you are. Well, I'm glad I found you before going to sleep. Now we have to actually do this. 
get these closed. And I'll see you guys bright and early. Maybe. We actually managed to sleep quite safe and sound, which I'm very surprised about. I think I'm just going to get out of there whilst we can. Cut our losses. I mean, not leave the town, just leave this area. I think I've looted most of it anyway. We've actually done fairly well, considering there was a, a huge heli attack. Very, very surprised we managed to stand our ground and actually get through that. But I'm equally as impressed. This guy's a tank. He's definitely putting the work in. Having that long blade skill has probably just saved our life. And it's going to save our life again today. Don't know how we've managed to attract this earth so quickly. But I do not like it one bit. Uh, is this going to be wild? No, surprisingly not. We've done well. We were extremely lucky or our efforts actually paid off. Either way, I'm not going to question it. I'm not going to complain. Just going to just gonna keep on loving it. <laughs> Revel in the beauty. Nice spear of gear. This machete is just something else. I need more of them. I really need more of them. Alright, there's a few more buildings I do want to check out. There's... Ah, it's not down there at all. Ah, nice axe. Thanks, friend. Ah, oh, no way is that paintbrush. Just a, just a paintbrush. Classic. Uh, we'll just check the ground just in case. No, just a paintbrush. So much for an axe, eh? Don't know whether... There is a big black building over here. There we go. There it is. Kind of thought it was the cranes, but... I'm guessing they're the little black squares on the map. That would make a lot of sense, actually. Oh, don't like it. This axe was doing so well earlier. Summer hat lady. I love it when those guys come out. Keeps the world exciting. Sundress and a summer hat. You can't beat it. Surprised we haven't found any pocket jerky yet. Big surprise. Is that a water bottle? I will take you. Just, just for the sake of it. Never have too many, can you? Another little workshop. A guy with a shotgun. A Ruger. Not a shotgun at all. Some brand new coveralls. Couple of lug wrenches. Yeah, nothing too crazy, really. Nothing we really need, anyway. Right, let's just head over to the far side. Uh, maybe do that a bit slower. We are just overweight now as well, which is not good. Means that fitness training is gone. Maybe just shift that in there. Don't think we're really going to need it. It was kind of a, a panic manoeuvre. Come on. Should probably find somewhere to rest pretty soon, though. It's got to be chasing our tail. Military desert boots. Ah, there we go. Assuming this is just a little train yard. With any luck, it's a cargo train yard. We can actually get something good out of it. Yeah, there we go. That's exactly what I was waiting for. Um, guess we could head back to that main building. Or do we try and get in here? Maybe the main building's the best shout. We've at least cleared half of this. Fingers crossed, this room here has somewhere to rest in. Yeah, boy. No gear, though. That's fine. Still impressed. Still so very impressed. He is just a walking tank. He's definitely earning a name for himself, that's for sure. Be up there with the boys. Probably as quickly as he could be down there with the boys. <laughs> We'd have died on that staircase. Probably would have cried. 
probably would have cried. Yeah, so far so good. Can we get in this side door or is that gate going to be locked? Unlocked. Surprisingly. Seems like we've got a bit of an army moving in there. That 10 Zs on our right. 10 Zs in front of us and 10 Zs on our left. Bring it in, ladies and gents. Do you got any wood glue? Duct tape? That'll do. We have got plenty of duct tape. We could always repair this again. It only does 25%, but it's better than nothing. And we're back on the car parts. Seems to be a lot of that round here. Not the worst thing. Not the worst thing, but kind of wanted weapons. Weapons and axes, but that's okay. Maybe there's got to be one smuggler around here. Just a little crate full of good gear. No. Just smuggling car parts. Propane torch, glass glue. I mean, all of this is great stuff. I'm, I'm not complaining at all. It might sound like I'm complaining, but I am equally as happy. Anything down here? Nope. We got one opposite and three over that end. Very nice. Question is, is this back end going to be as quiet as the front? Ten times quieter. This is lovely. Pat underscore Ren. Guessing he's a uh, little OG founder, either creator or supporter. Either way, big up that guy. Sounds like a great lad. Uh, that's not what I signed up for. <laughs> My machete is not on the back. Axe pulls through when you need it. Lovely job. There we go. Box of nails. Thank you, sir. Ah! Not expecting to turn around there. Let's unload that immediately. Can we just avoid them, please? You got this, Errol. It's not your first rodeo. Joking. May as well be his first rodeo. Okay, I'm not gonna. Okay, I'm gonna have to deal with him anyway. Just gonna say I'm not gonna climb in there, but he just decided to climb out of there. Alright, let's dip back a touch. Swing out the old machete and do this properly. You guys gonna play nice? There's one, there's two. Nicely done. And some wiggler. Yes, please, and thank you. Two boxes of nails. These guys are just unreal. Where did that go? There. Lovely. We need to consolidate all of that. There's a lot. It's starting to add up very quickly, too. Uh, cheap survivor knife I'll leave behind, I think. Can we get ourselves in? Should we try? Oh, we can. Result. Oh, let's just get these big doors open, I think. Let's open this place up properly. Much rather be a bit on edge, but have all the exits open than be very on edge and have Zeds banging on the doors behind me. Bit of effort to the madness. You're gonna stay down nicely? Yeah, you are. No, we can count on you. 
A little beauty. Take the duct tape. Actually panicked a bit there. <laughs> oh. Well, we better loot this before we call it a day, eh? Fingers crossed. We can bring that exhaustion right back down. Ah, oh, and the snow starts too. What a beautiful sight. Yes, Mr. Stab. There's got to be another one down, old Blondie. You next, and then Blondie. And uh, Greeny. Ah. I really thought this one. There we go. Then you. And green dress. Blondie's down too. There we go. Okay, I think I'm just gonna take a quick peek down here, see what we got, and then maybe call it a day. Whole lot of car parts again. Hmm. Not really ideal. This place has been valuable though, just not in a way that I wanted it to be, sadly. Spare engine parts are quite handy. Box of brake parts, tow bar. But again, we have equally found as much good gear as we have kind of not completely useful right now gear. Found a lot of wood glue, found a lot of duct tape, box of nails, just, yeah, so much good stuff. And, and we put skills to the test. We have stood a helicopter in a random town, in a random building. That's just peak survival right there. I don't think anything can stop them there. And I will take that probably very quickly to my grave. But yeah, I think on that pretty stellar note, I'm going to love you and leave you just there. Let's just take out old Greeny and then say goodbye with a cheeky chin stab. Nice. Anyway, I'm going to love you and leave you just there. Thanks for watching. Massive thanks to the member support on the channel. Like, subscribe if you enjoyed. Hopefully, stick around for the next one. Peace.